how to make um, my gluten-free, dairy-free pancakes that um, I use my um, gluten-free flour blend that's in my muffin recipe. So a bunch of you have bought the recipes now and I just wanted to give you one more thing that you can do with it. If you haven't purchased that yet, you can find that on our Etsy store. And you can also use any kind of all-purpose flour or you can use, um, you, you don't have to use gluten-free flour. So either way, these will work. My secret ingredient is molasses. It makes them really rich in flavor, and um, that's something my, my dad always put in pancakes when we had Monday morning pancakes every week. Okay. Hi, friend. Hi, Ben. <laughs> Say we're gonna make pancakes? <laughs> pancakes. Yeah. What are we gonna put in the pancakes? Yeah. What's this? That's the egg. Uh-huh, what's that? That's the cool. That's molasses. That's molasses. And flour. Yeah, flour. Coconut oil. Yeah, good oil. Coconut milk. Yeah, good milk. And sugar. Yeah. Cinnamon. Yeah. Nutmeg. Yeah. Salt. Yeah. Baking soda. Yeah. And baking powder. That. Yeah, that's all it takes, huh? Yes. <laughs> Most of the flowers that are in my mix I can pick up from um, Azure Standard. The molasses also comes from there. Coconut milk I have in a BPA-free can. Um, there's nothing in this but coconut and water. I don't like them with the guar gum and stuff in it. That I get from Amazon. Um, spices I buy from Vitacost and I buy from our um, local grocery market. The baking powder comes from um, Azure Standard and the baking soda I get from Costco. So, And then coconut oil, I usually can get it from Costco this last time I couldn't, so I picked it up at Winco Foods. Okay, let's do it, Mom. Let's do it. <laughs> okay. Put it in. I like to make these in the blender. It's just one thing, there's no cleanup, and I can easily dump it out of there. So that's the way I do my pancakes. Good job, baby. There you go. Thank you. You need a scraper for that one, huh? Hey, you, Mom. Okay, can you put the last one in? Mixer, Annabelle. Yes, we get the old money. It's good, Mom. All right. I'll push it out, okay? Okay, you wait a minute. Good job, Mom. So now that we've got the ingredients mixed, we want to make sure that we get it the right thickness. I usually start with about a half a cup of water. You can use milk for this. Um, well, I talk. Okay, what do you want to say? Uh, I'm going to talk it. Say, so, time to put in the water. You need plenty of room for the water. Okay, you're going to turn it on? Yeah. Mm -hmm. 